Hello everyone, welcome to the sixth video in my how to build a computer series in Minecraft. Um, in this video we'll be continuing with the RAM and uh, we'll be in the RAM addressing. So we'll, uh, uh, yeah, for the read and the write functions. Um, once again I apologise for the delay in the uploads. Um, yeah, I've just been busy recently. Uh, that's about it. Um, so to do this binary addressing system, we're going to use a binary to decimal decoder. Um, and I'm going to use a piston one, which is quite quick. Only about three ticks, I think, maximum. So, um, so for this, we have, I think, do we have eight slots? Of, yeah, eight slots of RAM. So one, two, three, four. Yeah, eight slots. So, uh, and to represent eight in binary, it's uh, the fourth digit, so we need four digits to represent uh, all of these different addresses. Um, so to begin with, just uh, build, build, uh, build this. I'll explain it later on. Okay, like so. So uh, each of our like each of our bits, so our numbers in binary, will go in like above one of these slots. So the and uh, this needs to be copied and like stacked for each of the different uh, different addresses. So I'll just stack this a few times. Okay, so now we have our uh, eight, um, our eight like addresses. We can start building the proper part of the decoder. So, um, in uh, so this first slot will be number one. This will the second one will be number two, third, and three, so on, so on. Uh, sorry for pointing out the obvious. Um, and wherever you want a bit to be decoded, you need to place a block in the air two above. So for number one. We uh, we want the first bit to be coded uh, to be decoded. For number two, we want two in binary. For number three, we want um, two and one. That's how you represent three in binary. Four is the uh, the next bit across. Five is four and one. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. Um, what's it now? Uh, six, which is four and two, obviously. Seven, um, seven, which is four, two, and one. Uh, there we go. Got rid of that one. Uh, where was it up to? Okay, seven. And finally, eight, which is the fourth and final bit. Okay, so now we've got all of these, uh, all of these blocks placed. We can um, add in the rest of the blocks. So wherever there's not already a block, you just place a block like so. Um, I can stack this because I'm lazy. Stack that six times. Uh, I'm not going to be able to do that for any more, I don't think. In a second, hopefully you can see that better now. Oops. Make sure you... Uh, Keep all these repeaters on one tick of delay, so they're the fastest. There's no point adding uh, unnecessary delay. Is that them all? Oh no, I've missed quite a few. And um, recently, well, well today, I've uh, started work on a new introduction. 
um, which I should get going in like the next few videos, maybe two videos time or something like that. Um, so that should be quite good. Okay, so that's all of these done now. Uh, at the moment it just looks like a random array of blocks, but it will make more sense. Now above every single block you need to place a, uh, another block. So uh, I might I might cut out part of this because it does get quite boring. Actually, uh, no, I'll um, I'll keep it all in, so you um, know what's going on. There is a quicker way of doing this because binary follows a pattern. Um, so this will go up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, and this will go um, up. Uh, no, go down, up, up, down, down, up, up, and so on, so on. But um, well, oh gosh, is that right? Oh, uh, we found I've done this wrong. One, two. Oh no. Sorry about that. So yeah, you can. Uh, binary does follow a pattern, which would allow me would have allowed me to stack this. But uh, I don't know why I didn't do that to be honest. But now, oh, well, too late now. Oh, this is slow. <clears throat> well, sorry about my voice. And that is done. Now you need to uh, whip out your sticky pistons. And yeah, I don't need that green for it. Oh, I bother. Did this in wrong colour. Oh well, I'll uh, I'll change this to green or something at the end. And uh, place pistons facing down on every single one of these blocks. Damn it. Why does everything have to be so fiddly? You know what? I'm just going to stack this one like I did before because it'll save me some time. Uh, stack that um, six times. Okay, there we go. I'll start again at this side. Oh, bother. Hopefully everyone's keeping up with this okay. It's uh it's not that complicated really. And uh, I'll try and explain it a little bit uh, in more depth when I finish building it. But to be honest, it's pretty self-explanatory the way I've built it. Last one. Okay, now we are... Uh, sorry about that lag. Um, now we need to just join all these up like so. Uh, yeah, I'll do it like this. And there we go. Place redstone on all of these. And voila. So it oops. What did I do then? Enable noon does. Well, that's a new feature I didn't realise. Oh well, I'll keep it like that. Um, so yeah, this is where the binary, uh, your binary like address would go in. So if, um, say you're running a program, you say, okay, I want to, uh, 
I want to save whatever's coming through here, coming out of here, save it into address number four. You'd uh, you'd go, okay, I'll um, light this torch up, and as you can see, number four is being uh, outputted, and it's saved to that address. It's a very, very nice design, and it doesn't quite reach, which is annoying. Uh, so I'm going to have to add repeaters here. And uh, blocks above here. Check out work. So yeah. Um, now I will change the colour of all these blocks because I've got OCD. And in uh, and then I'll just copy and paste it down one so we can do it for the right functions as well. Um, okay. Good feeling this is going to be in a long video. Feels long. Anything to do with decoders is always boring. Okay. Now then, uh, I think if we do replace wool, red wool, um, orange. I'll do orange. I think that should work. Yeah, very nice. Okay, so now I've got a load of orange. And I'll do the one underneath it green, I think. Uh, I've already got that area selected, so I can um, I can copy it down one. So go from here. Copy. And then. Paste. And there we go. Once again, I'll just change the colour because I like to differentiate between different parts of each each uh, each bit of the uh, computer. I might end up splitting this video into two parts. Depends if it goes above uh, 10 minutes. I like to give them in 10 minute chunks. Okay, um, I can just hit that, fun that um, command again. Wool light green. Well, that didn't work. Oh, yeah. I need to change this to orange. Very nice. Okay, so the top ones you read, uh, uh, you write, sorry, and the bottom ones are your read. I um, hope that was uh, clear enough for you. Thanks for watching. Please like, uh, comment, and subscribe.